My friends, we take some time today to join Mary, the mother of God, in prayer. We remember that Jesus came to serve God's people and now is our Lord in heaven. Mary, his mother, was God's humble servant when she was on earth. She followed Jesus and helped him with his work. She cares about us and, like all the saints, prays for us. Because she is first among the saints and angels, we honor her. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with begin our prayer in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Holy God, you chose Mary to be the mother of your son, Jesus. She had the courage to say yes to you, even though she knew it would be hard. Keep us safe from the danger of evil. Help us to follow her example by living a healthy and holy life. We ask this to our Lord, Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Our Gospel. A reading from the Gospel according to Luke. A short time later, Mary hurried to a town in the hill country of Judea. She went into Zechariah's home, where she greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, her baby moved within her. The Holy Spirit came upon Elizabeth. Then in a loud voice, she said to Mary, God has blessed you more than any other woman. She has blessed the child that you will have. Why should the mother of my Lord come to me? As soon as I heard you greeting, my baby became happy and moved within me. The Lord has blessed you because you believed that he will keep his promise. Mary said, With all my heart I praise the Lord, and I am glad because of God my Savior. He cares for me, his humble servant. From now on, all people will say, God has blessed me. 
God all-powerful has done great things for me, and his name is holy. He shows mercy to everyone who worships him. The Lord has used his powerful arm to sc scatter those who are proud. He drags strong rulers from their thrones and, put, and puts humble people in places of power. God gives the hungry good things to eat and sends the rich away with nothing. He helps his servant Israel and is always merciful to his people. The Lord made this promise to our ancestors, to Abraham and his family forever. Mary stayed with Elizabeth about three months. Then she went back home. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise you, Lord Jesus Christ. Today, as we offer our prayers of petition, we ask Mary to pray to God for us, for our needs. We honor Mary by using many of the titles the church has given to her throughout the ages. This ancient prayer form is called a litany. At the end of each statement, each prayer, let us respond, pray for us. Lord have mercy on us. Christ have mercy on us. Lord have mercy on us. God the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, Holy Mother of God, Mother of Christ, Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother of Good Counsel, pray for us. Mother of our Creator, pray for us. Mother of our Savior, pray for us. Virgin Most Merciful, pray for us. Virgin Most Faithful, pray for us. Gate of Heaven, pray for us. Morning Star, pray for us. Health of the Sick, pray for us. Refuge of Sinners, pray for us. Comforter of the Afflicted, Pray for us. Help of Christians. Pray for us. Queen of the Angels. Pray for us. Queen of Prophets. Pray for us. Queen of Apostles. Pray for us. Queen of Martyrs. Pray for us. Queen of Confessors. Pray for us. Queen of All Saints. Pray for us. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Pray for us. Queen of Peace. Pray for us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. We ask Mary, the mother of all people, to join our prayer to stop meanness, fighting, and war. Pray for us. We ask Mary, whose child, Jesus, was killed, to join our prayer for the safety of children everywhere. Pray, Pray for, for us. us. We ask Mary, whose family is holy, to join our prayer for our families. Pray, Pray for, for us. us. We ask Mary, who calls each of us her children, to bless the second graders who recently made their first Holy Communion and our eighth graders as they prepare for their new adventures in high school. Pray for us. We ask Mary, who obeyed God in love and in trust, to help us to love her son more and more each day. Pray for us. Let us join our prayers of petition with the special prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. As we close our celebration in honor of Mary, the mother of God, we join in a special ancient prayer. This prayer was written to be said especially during Easter time. Queen of heaven, rejoice, alleluia. The son whom you merited to bear, alleluia, has risen as he said, alleluia. Rejoice and be glad, O Virgin Mary, alleluia. For the Lord is truly risen. Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May Jesus Christ, the Son of Mary, bless our work and our play. Amen. Amen. May Mary, Christ's first disciple, inspire us to follow Jesus closely. Amen. Amen. May the Holy Spirit who filled Mary with courage fill us with joy. Amen. Amen. May God bless us, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our prayer is ended. Let us go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God.